Hey guys, it's me. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, I appreciate you as always. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And check out the links in the description box below for some money off your purchases. I'm going to jump right into this story. I feel like usually I ramble on a little bit before I start, but I'm going to jump right in. Met this guy. We're going to call him Larry. I don't know why Larry is the name that stuck out, but Larry, right? Met him at a brunch I went to with some coworkers back last month. Um, we exchanged Instagrams. A couple likes here and there, uh, responding to my story or whatever. And then on September 2nd, he asked for my number. I'm being specific with dates here. So I'm recording this video on Wednesday, September 8th. Um, that means we've only been texting for about six, seven days, right? So conversation's been cool, trying to flirt, being, you know, corny jokes, whatever, getting to know me, asking me questions, it's fine. He's younger than me. I clearly don't learn, right? Like third time is not a charm with the younger guys, but if you don't know what I'm talking about with the last younger guy that tried to talk to me, or maybe I was wrong, maybe he wasn't trying to talk to me, but I will link that video up above. Either way, he's also a younger guy. Um, conversation was pretty good, he texts back fast, cool. So yesterday, Tuesday, September 7th, I decided I was gonna binge watch clickbait. So my sister was with me and she was like, oh, we could watch it together even though I already saw it, but I don't mind watching it again. I'm like, cool. So I started watching it about 1.45, right? We were texting at the time, but I stopped texting because I was so like into the, the show. Like I literally kept watching. I did not move from my seat for about seven hours. Each episode was like 45 minutes. So I finally texted him back and I was like, oh, I was watching um, clickbait just now. Um, you know, I binged the season. Well, I didn't say I binged the season, but I said I was watching clickbait just now. He's like, for seven hours, cap. Um, I literally responded, I said, oh, um, okay. And then he's like, yeah, it's cool though, what you doing? So after that, I decided to respond and say, so you're insinuating I'm lying? So he proceeds to send me a 30 second voice note. I guess he wanted to, I don't know, I can't say plead his case, but he wanted to express to me how he was feeling. The voice will be altered, you know, because I don't know if no, anybody knows his voice, if it sounds familiar. So I don't really want to put him out there like that. So the voice is going to be altered, but y'all yeah, listen. There's no way anyone hasn't touched a phone for seven hours. Women, man, fucking fifth grader who's... <laughs> who just discovered TikTok, seven hours, no. You could have texted me back, you know what I'm saying? Not that I care, I'm just saying like, you could have me back, like, yo, I'm watching this, da, da, da. For seven hours, there's no way no one touched their phone for not seven hours unless they shit was completely dead and had no charge or none of that. Like, come on, like, it's me. Like, I, I know, like, come on, it's like. Okay, so. First of all, who are you talking to? It's giving weird. Like, that was really my first reaction to the voice note. Like, who do you think you're talking to? You're not entitled to my time. I feel like there's gonna be men in the comments like, well, he trying to get to know you, so how are you not gonna answer him for seven hours? I was watching a show and I legit was not looking at my phone for seven hours. The show, eight episodes, 45 minutes. I did not touch my phone. I don't know if y'all don't know how to put down y'all phones, like, but I do, I do know how to do that. So like, it's possible. And like, what, why should I lie to you? But why are you entitled to my time? Why should I be telling you exactly what I'm doing every moment? Like, oh, sorry, I can't text you back for the next couple hours. I'm gonna be watching a show. It was random as hell that I decided to watch it and I binged it. Like, not that I care though. Sweetie, you do. Because if you didn't care, I wouldn't have gotten a voice note. There's no way that that irked you so much that I needed to get a voice note with all of that. And like, come on, it's me. My nigga, I don't know you. Who are these niggas? <laughs> it's me. I, I literally just met you a month ago and we literally just started texting six days ago. I don't know you to say, come on, it's me. Like, I'm telling you what I did and that's why I didn't answer. I actually didn't even have to say anything. I could have just been like, oh, what's up? What you doing? 
I could have literally just kept the convo going, but no, I instead I decided to tell you, hey, sorry, I didn't look at my phone. I was watching clickbait. I got caught up. I didn't have to give you that explanation. I don't know if it's a it's a younger thing with this one, like this situation. I don't know if it's uh yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna go with age with this one. I might have to go with age. Um, because I'm not understanding it. Okay, because I literally don't have to text you ever again. So my response, because of course I always have to say something back, is just in me. I sent a voice note back about 30 seconds also, and I said, um, I don't know you, you don't know me. Um, you're insinuating that I'm lying and that's not the type of energy I'm on. So we can end this conversation right now. You have a blessed night. Cause that, that's what you're gonna get out of me. Cause I could have been like, yo, who the fuck you talking to? You don't know me like that. Like, I'm like, no, I'm not giving you no rah-rah energy because I don't know you. I don't know you well enough. I don't like you well enough. And now I don't care to get to know you. So here we are. Either way, that's my story. Just wanted to give it to y'all straight. Y'all let me know like what's wrong, what's wrong with the people in the world. Should I be changing like who I date as a gender? Like what should I be doing? Cause it may, okay, 30, I gotta start dating between 30 and like 36. I think that's the age gap I'm gonna start looking for. Anything younger than 28, I, my age, I cannot date you. And I'm about to be 29, so like, 29 year olds and up, 29 to, yeah, 29 to like 36. Hit me up. Maybe, maybe I can figure it out there, those ages. But I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see y'all soon. Bye.